Hello, hello, everybody. Yep, we're looking good over there. All right. Yes, I know I'm facing away. Give me one hot moment while I... There we go. So, <clears throat> as you've probably been able to guess, I am still dealing with a dead monitor. Uh, replacement has not arrived yet, but that's okay. It'd be that way. Um, but yes, hello, hello, everybody, and welcome back to my stream. Um, we will be back. Uh, no, we, we will be back. <laughs> Goodbye. No. Um, <laughs> uh, God, uh, what was I trying to say? We are back with late to the uh, late to the bandwagon where tonight we are starting, as you can see somewhere around here, I think. Uh, somewhere somewhere down here in this corner, I believe. Uh, Gotham Knights. New game to me. New-ish game to the world. It's been out, I want to say a year-ish. Ish. Um, I'm excited. I'm excited. That's just all I have to say is I'm excited. Um, excuse me. Um, but before we get properly started, just as a reminder... I've got a link tree. In said link tree, we have a Patreon for me, as well as a throne wish list. Throne.com slash Crimson Knights, as well as Patreon.com slash Crimson Knight, just as it's shown on the screen. Those are just some quick, easy ways that you can uh, support me and my streams and my content. Uh, if you so choose. If not, I won't hold it. I, I won't hold it against you. Um, <coughs> but uh, yeah. Anyway, um, there's also a bunch of other awesome stuff down in that link tree. So check that out. Link tree slash Crimson Knight. Anyway, uh, do I have any other announcements? Not really. Um, no, not really. So let's just go ahead and get started make sure it did it did make sure we'll quickly check make sure everything's coming through okay microphone is game audio is okay now i just need to pop that back so i can keep an eye on it and allons-y Oh, wait. I hit continue, didn't I? Not new game. Shoot. I played, like, the first five-ish minutes of the game. Um, and I think I pushed the wrong button. I meant to start a new game. I played the first five-ish minutes and was like, nah, I want to stream this. <laughs> um... <clears throat> Yep, I was right. Okay. Uh, return to main menu. Yep. Okay. Trying this again. New game! There we go. Yes, I'm okay with that, overriding my save data. Um, let's see here. Thinking medium or hard. Now nah, we'll do medium, mainly because I haven't played. I haven't, like I said, I haven't played this game before. Um, I don't want either of the easies, but we'll do medium because I'm familiar with the style of game because I love the Arkham Knight, the Arkham series, um, and uh, I'm familiar with. So I'm familiar with the Arkham series, which is this is loosely based off of. Um, Um, let's see here. Co-op unlocks as you progress through the main story. These are the options for when co-op becomes available public. No. Shoot. Uh, hold, please. Bear with me. Yes, I'm sure that that's what I want to do. Okay. Come on, 
Here we go. All right. There we go. Uh, yes, we accept. This is an important thing for everybody. Be aware of this. Seizures and epilepsy and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. I wish it wouldn't tell me that every time. Check your unique username. Trust me, Crimson Knight is... Uh-huh, 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 there we go. Eh, eh, and friends only. There we go. Okay, so. Uh, we'll leave those as they are. Alright, so real quick. Graphics. Um, we'll keep it on that. Need V-Sync. Mm hmm Okay. All right. Cool. Audio. Um. Go with headphones. Uh, yep. That's what we'll do. Uh, voice chat off. I don't need to mess with controls because I know those are right. Yeah, and I can always change them if I need to as I go. Um. <laughs> yep. Okay. Full captions. Small. Colorblind mode. <sighs> uh, what we'll do is we'll do this. There we go. No. I think the rest of that's fine. If you're watching this, I'm dead. I wish he was voiced by Kevin Conroy. Rip. Rip the goat. There goes the belt. And for what? Corruption still flourishes in Gotham, lurking in every shadow. You don't need that mask. I know it's you. Rachel Ghoul. You allowed this blasphemy, this sacrilege. Did you think you could keep it from me?
Batgirl, Nightwing, Robin, and Red Hood all inbound. This really should have been a sequel to Arkham Knight. The proud dad. You'll be dead before they get you. Your precious family. I will slaughter them. One. Breath. I will burn the city to the ground. You won't get a chance. Gotham is their city now.
and then he blew up Wayne Manor in the Batcave. Which, at this point, still fits very much with Arkham Knight's lore. The only real difference is the voices, the designs, and the fact that Barbara's not in a wheelchair. <clears throat> triggered when I destroyed the cave and everything it contained. No arm. I know what's coming won't be easy. There! Now that's an arm. criminals to realize the Batman is gone. You can't count on the GCPD. Never trusted us since Jim died. You are clear to engage. Deviation number two. Jim Gordon is dead in this. Technically three, I guess, if you got the art designs, I mean... Technology is out there, <clears throat> but it has the gear you need and all of my files. Catherine Kane. Many of you knew Bruce from Gotham's celebrity pages. A handsome, charming Jacob millionaire. Kane. And he was that. But he was more than a headline. He was my nephew. He was a friend, a mentor, oh, Alfred. and a benefactor to those of us gathered here today. And to those of you who didn't know him as we did, I want to tell you this. Bruce was Gotham. He loved this city more than he loved anything. He was a protector to this city. He worked tirelessly behind the scenes to bring justice and equality. There's nothing he wouldn't do. No project he wouldn't champion if he thought Gotham would benefit. And I think in remembering that, we remember Bruce as he truly was. You've always had my back when I needed you. I know you'll keep Gotham safe. Good luck. And goodbye.
Cosmos, Alfred. What you'd expect. Took him three years to agree to a vacation, and Bruce turned up dead. He asked for some time. He knows none of us were there either, right? What about you? You let Jacob Kane give the eulogy. He offered. He thought it'd be easier on us if he was the one to do it. He's Bruce's uncle. Hell of a speech. All that talk about a protector who works behind the scenes. If he only knew. Catherine wouldn't be there if she suspected. I can't see the anti-vigilante police commissioner presiding at Batman's funeral. Here's something else she doesn't know. She has the body of Batman's killer in her morgue. Rachel Ghoul is listed as a John Doe, slated for cremation. And what if the League of Shadows finds him? If they drop their dear leader in a Lazarus pit, he won't be so dead anymore. You want to break into the GCPD headquarters for a what if? Be my guest. I decrypted the case Batman sent with his message. We should focus on that. I looked it over, but did I get everything? It doesn't look complete. I think Raish interrupted him while he was writing. He says this has implications that could shake Gotham to its core. Ominous, but not exactly helpful. <coughs> I saw a few places we should poke around. Construction sites, a quarry. He also mentioned a Dr. Langstrom. Anyone know him? He's a zoologist at Gotham University. Not sure what his connection is, though. Let's divide up the work. We can meet at the Belfry when we're done. Get it up and running. Who gets to talk to Langstrom? All right, so Tim Drake, Robin. Character proficiency is stealth specialist, tactical genius, bow staff prodigy. Brute strength, Jason Todd, Red Herd, uh, Red Herd, Red Herd. <laughs> um, Jason Todd, Red Hood, Brute strength, powerhouse brawler, master marksman. Barbara Gordon, Batgirl, expert hacker, tough as nails, single target bruiser. Dick Grayson, Nightwing, gifted acrobat, rapid combos, a scream of stick expert, and my personal favorite. Gotham U. What's the story so far with this professor? Kirk Langstrom. Judging by the half-finished file with the code black, Batman was digging into him hardcore. Eyes open and ready for anything, then. Cops are down there. Ah, helps if I'm holding the right button. Crap. 
Bad news. Langstrom is dead. Any idea where I can find his office? Langstrom's dead? Oh, hold on. Just checking GU's website. Uh, here we go. His office is on the third floor in Molten Hall. Thank you. The balcony doors are open. That's my way in. Body cam recording. Makes sense they'd wear body cams. Evidence and all that. Here we go. Kirk Langstrom, here we go. The cops didn't spend much time here. Langstrom must have died somewhere else. Right here. These marks are suspicious. I wonder what made them. Do you hear anything else in here? All I have is dead end so far. I feel like this might turn into something. You'd like it. I'm breaking into a lab. Always did love a good break in. Even that night you accidentally tripped the alarm? Excuse me, that was you. I'll see if there's anything else to this lead. Stay safe. You too. Oh, look at the glowy eye lenses. Yes. This is a lot of damage. This is where Langstrom died. You'd think the GCPD would still be all over this lab. Looks like Langstrom was attacked at his workstation. He lost a lot of blood. He tried to get away, and then the attacker pinned him to the wall. Brutal. Langstrom spent his final moments crawling toward that cabinet. Why didn't he try to leave the lab? Holy crap, it's a hidden door. What were you hiding, Dr. Langstrom? Okay, investigate the crime scene, search for evidence, and uncover the truth. Use the mouse and arrow keys to explore the crime scene with the cursor. Important items will be identified by a magnifying glass icon. This movie meant something to Langstrom. The release date could be significant. Langstrom made specific note of these dates, and now I will too. A phone number. It's not a Gotham area code. Could be something. The thermostat could definitely double as a keypad. I've never seen a microwave like this before. Maybe it's for more than just late night burritos. Langstrom's tablet might be remote access to the door. That 
Let's try this. Let's find out what secrets this guy was keeping. Supplies, stuff, okay. Those are bats. Makes sense, knowing who Kirk Langstrom is in the comics. And who he was in the Arkham series. Well, this is something. The guy was playing God, or at least dabbling. Red ring, red king crab specimen. Multiple DNA signatures detected. Giant salamander specimen, endangered species. Shark specimen. Sharks have a unique immune system that makes them ideal candidates for experiments. That sucks that for meant sharks. The professor was researching some real sketchy stuff. Cuttlefish specimen. Specimen. Cephalopods have unique RNA editing enzymes. A spider crab specimen. Multiple DNA signatures detected. Whoa! Miscellaneous specimens. Multiple small uh, experiments in discrete containers. Whoa! Langstrom's desk. Various failed experiments, all deceased. Okay, let's look at this first. Tissue samples, animal, animal skin cells, fatty tissue, and other organic material. Organic material collected from various animal samples seem to be primarily sourced from creatures in Langstrom's lab tanks. Notes also mention fatty tissues from a dolphin, tenrec cells, and orangutan saliva. Yum. What's this? Hard drive. Come on. That's there you a go. hard drive. Might have some answers. Better get this back to the Belfry. Hey, I think I'm done here. Cops cleared out quick. Missed some weird marks in the walls, in a hidden lab, with an even more hidden hard drive. Can't wait to decrypt that bad boy. See you soon. Science exhibit each year, Gotham University's biology students spotlight the scientists who inspire them. This year's exhibit features Dr. Erdid Orson and Dr. Gilbert Giles' collaborative breakthroughs in cellular, cellular fusion, as well as Dr. Niles Calder. Hey, that's a comic book reference that I recognize. The guy who's behind uh, the Doom Patrol, who recently gained a bit, brief bit of mainstream attention for his recent neuroscience paper. Someone see me?
Come on, bitch. The freaks. What are they doing here? Gang activity's been ramping up without Batman around. Guess the freaks want to join the party. Someone ought to teach them a lesson. I'm on it. from burning this place to the ground. Better to stay hidden. Are the fumes getting to you, buddy? That was unnecessarily flirty, Nightwing. No one will. Still enjoying a life of crime. That high there was way too flirty. Oh, oh. Broken. <laughs> Let's 
see if you'll break too. Get to safety. Go. Hold heavy melee attacks to break guards. Okay. now with Langstrom's hard drive. Finally. Cool. After you grab a criminal with cab, Tap Q to interrogate them. Okay, so you can interrogate. Um, you can inter interrogate criminals with that symbol above their head. Don't harm citizens. Okay, so defeating GCPD officers doesn't get us anything. Okay, cool. Interesting. It's fucking cool, I love it. <laughs> God, the city is gorgeous.
The Oracle symbol. Nice work grabbing that drive from Langstrom's lab. Do we have any idea of what killed Langstrom yet? Hard to say much until these computers are up and running. Or we can examine the body, but for what it's worth, my gut says we're dealing with a who, not a what. That makes me feel slightly better, I guess. Once we can get at the data, we can figure out what our next move is. I'm going out. I'm not gonna sit and wait for whatever this shit is. We're waiting for intel, Jason. Once we have it, then we'll go. <laughs> move. I'm gonna solve this case my way. wanted us to work this together. Whatever. That's making this harder than it has to be, kid. I guess, since we're waiting anyway, we might as well take another look at what Bruce had on Langstrom. Crap. That must have been the secondary breaker. The primary went out months ago. I thought the backup would hold. I got it. No need. I've put in a small fix that should hold for a while. No. Oh, Wasn't Alfred. sure you were coming, Alfred. I'll always be here when you need me, Master Richard. When any of you need me. Oh. I'm glad you're here. As am I, Master Tim. This place does need work. Damn it. We've got activity all over the city. Sweet. Looks like my plan wins. Hold up. We still need the intel. And Alfred can't exactly set this place up alone. Indeed, Miss Gordon. I have a list of supplies we'll need. I could do it on my own, but... It would be faster if I had help. You can count on us, Alfred. We'll divvy it up. Let's finish what Bruce started. Hey, Tim. How'd it go at the quarry? Not well. I sweeped the whole place and didn't find anything. No one's been there in ages. How are we supposed to see the full picture when most of the pieces are missing? Bruce left us one hell of a last case. I mean, what kind of person builds a secret lab in their lab? Someone who has something to hide, obviously. Gotham. What? What were you <laughs> trying to make, and who is he hiding it from? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's wait and see what that hard drive has to tell us first. Right. We'll get some answers soon enough. Over here. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Training area. That's going to be important. New game on all. Um... Yeah, I'll get to the abilities menu in a second. I'm touring. I'm taking a tour. Okay, so there will be some stuff up here, it looks like. Maybe a collectibles area. Maybe. Ooh, big ass TV on the wall. The hangout area. Got it. 
Can I hop over? No? Okay. Standard home base, 90% of your controls don't work in the base. Got it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Ability points. Leveling up your character awards ability points that can be spent to learn new abilities. Spending ability points also unlocks access to new abilities. All right, so we have one ability point. If you get the perfect evade. Yeah, let's do that. Momentum abilities. As you continue your investigation, each hero can unlock unique momentum abilities. E use the momentum abilities to menu to unlock conditions and to view unlock conditions and unlocked abilities. You just unlocked your first momentum ability. Momentum abilities are unique to each character and require momentum to activate. When ready, the ability icon in the lower right corner of the screen will change. To use a momentum ability, tap the assigned button. Alright, so we have a pounce! A pounce! Oh, look at that. Okay. Uh, one momentum cost. Okay, cool. Um, okay. Uh, database stuff. No, thank you. No. No, we're not going to worry about that right now. Ooh, gear. Okay. Langstrom Drive. Ugh, nose. Okay, gear first. Um, because I am not a fan of the, uh, default outfits. And because this is the definitive edition, I have specialty gifts. Look at that. Okay. So what we're gonna do is swap to that we're gonna swap to that uh okay there's some crap there's a crafting thing okay i guess that makes sense okay mods wait what oh this one this one and i could customize the styles all right so there's all right uh the current suit new guard eh. titan interesting oh this is Dick Grayson. We got to check. Did they do the butt? Dick Grayson is known for having an amazing ass in the comics. He's got one in the Beyond suit. A decent one in the Eternal suit. Year one. Hey, ooh, I like that. All right. Baggy pants hides it. Neon noir. I don't know about the hairstyle, my dude. Um. Demon. Woo. Woo. Privateer. Metal. <laughs> There's, there's the actual Beyond suit. Night Ops. Shinobi. Night Watch. Now, this one... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. The person who rendered this one really, really has opinions about Nightwing's, um... 
appearance, <laughs> physicality. He's hung. He he's hung. He he's 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 got the bull. He's got a hell of a bulge in this suit. Let's just put it that way. The talon, okay. Talon suit. Knighthood. Ooh, I like that one. I like that one. Raider. And then, okay, we're back here. All right. All right, so. So we can change colors. Cowl. Let's change the cowl to. Um. I think I like that one better. Symbol. Um. I like that one best. Like in that one and the boots that one well no we'll do that one for the gloves that way they match the boots yeah all right there we go i like that all right at least until we get you know some more options colors so we got the iconic alpha tribute asylum this is the this is based on the color scheme of the of his suit in arkham Asi in the arkham series which i think is probably what i'm gonna go with because it's a darker blue and a darker black you know chroma frost ultra zurinar yes yes i love the zurinar color scheme but like just as the aesthetic of it because of the red but no uh we're, we're gonna go with this all right all right all right all right okay we'll worry about mods and stuff as we go we went with the beyond suit because it's got more power than the stock suit same reason we went with the uh upgrade of these all right why won't it let me oh do i need to unlock it first i need to unlock it first okay look at that suit I'm assuming at some point I'll be able to change and uh, to swap to one of these other characters. Exit the Belfry and patrol Gotham. How dark is it on? On the you don't stream, think the let's freaks see. had anything to do with the murder, do you? The freaks have no qualms about killing people. Still, this isn't their MO. I doubt it was them. It's kind of dark on stream. Let's let's lighten that up a bit. Um, oops, no. Uh, graphics. Or is it? Yeah, it's probably bright brightness. Let's brighten that up a little bit. Great. So that just narrows it down to every other criminal in Gotham. There we go. That's not as bad. Yeah, that's not as bad. Okay. It was pretty dark on my screen, so I, I figured you guys would be probably having trouble. Tap X AR to display nearby opportunistic crimes. They appear as triangles in the HUD. Oh, you can open the back computer remotely. Gotham City Map. Crimes you discover during patrol can be viewed on the map, along with any additional activities you have available. Once a we'll place a waypoint to track the best route to a crime or location. Okay. All right, so we're at the Belfry. Let's take a look at whole, uh, good old girl. All right, so we got Lower Gotham, Historic Gotham. Right Corner Islands. Uh, New Gotham north gotham 
North, Go North Gotham has Gotham Heights, which I believe is near where the Wayne, where Wayne Manor was, though it's not actually, yeah. Robinson Park, Bristol. Actually, that might be where the, unless that's Arkham. No, that's Arkham, Arkham Asylum. Okay. City Cemetery. Why do they have the cemetery near the uh, the asylum? Planetarium. I love that they give you street names. There's the university. That's where we were a bit ago. Okay. West End Gotham. DC General Hospital. GCPD, major crime units. Uh, the Gazette. Chelsea Tunnel. Fox Tekka. Wayne Tower. There she is. The old Butte. Knight's Dome. Sporting Complex. The Monarch Theater. The Monarch Theater, if I remember correctly, is where is the uh is near where the uh Waynes were murdered. They have Crime Alley marked. Yeah, Park Row. Yeah, Park Row. And then Yeah, it's like back here is where the Waynes were murdered. More or less. Um Cape Carmine, named for Carmine Falcone, or vice versa, actually. Um, down to the Iceberg Lounge, run by the Penguin. Co Oswald Cobblepot, Elliott Center, Quartz Labs, GCN, Union Station Belfry, which is where we are, Powers Club, as in, oh god, I know that's a reference to a thing. Powers. I'm blanking. GCPD Central Station. GC Cathedral. Gordon Memorial. Oh, Gordon Memorial. I need to go to that. I need to. I need to. Gotham City Hall. Paris Island. Cobblepot Steel. Star Labs, hey. Ocarin Chemicals, Wayne Tech, Dixon Docks. Yeah. Man, this makes me really happy. There's Blackgate. Alright, let's go let's go to Gordon. Let's go see Gordon. Uh, the Gordon uh thing first. that way actually train oh can I not ride the train but I want to ride the train let me on the train <coughs> <coughs> like for real look can I ride the train I'll take that as a no Bike. Oh, it's down below me. Okay. Fine. I guess I should get to the street, huh? Oh, no, this is where we parked it. Right. Hey, buddy.
I miss gliding around as Batman. Though this works, you know? Gotham City called and we have answered and we will never abandon her James Gordon and memoriam in memory of the officers of the GCPD who gave their lives in the Vietnam War in memory of the officers of the GCPD who gave their lives in the Second World War in memory of the officers of the GCPD who gave their lives in the Korean War. In honor of the law enforcement officers who made the ultimate sacrifice during the Gotham City riots of 83. Your watch has ended, but you will not be forgotten. Jim Gordon. Bravery, integrity, justice, loyalty. Jim Gordon, the only cop who ACAB genuinely does not apply to. Well, and Renee Montoya. Oh, wrong button. Oh, it helps if I'm in the right. There we go. Um, let's see here. We need to do some some uh, ooh, challenges. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, I have a new map. Oh, oh, it's locked. Okay. Map. Okay. I need to do some exploration to find some criminals. Please. They're just gonna make trouble. Some criminals. Belly. What Big Belly Burger. Restroom for, restrooms for customer use only. Oops, wrong button. Well, well. They were trying to break into a wine store, apparently. Oh, I hear some gunshots. Not exactly new in Gotham. Definitely unnerving. Just do 
doing my part. Stay safe. Hey, we could do it. Damn. If you want to leave. <laughs> Belfry here. Happy to report we're now fully operational. Before you head back, though, you got something, Belfry? The hard drive from Langstrom's lab requires a bio decryption key. That sounds like it's in his body, which is at the morgue. Indeed. With knights in Gotham as they are, it should be quiet at the station. Relatively. I guess I did want to see how Montoya was handling the new commissioner. I'll let you know what I find. Montoya, Renee Montoya. One of the other genuinely good cops. <clears throat> Becomes the question in the comics for a bit, if not permanently. Definitely a part, technically a part of the Bat family. Ooh. That was not intentional. a little easier at least Oh, wow. Okay, so there's a cop I can't there. Just ask the front desk where they're keeping Langstrom's body. The morgue's on the far side of the bullpen. Make sure the cops don't see you sneaking around. Yeah, yeah. There's got to be a sneakier way in. Yeah. Goddamn freaks. That's my daughter's school. We got a few in lockup. One collar in interrogation. I'd pay a hundred bucks for five minutes alone in there. A cab. Did anyone claim that John Doe body? Buff guy, wild outfit. Nope. Damn. Works pretty packed with that scientist now. You turned your body cam off right in front of Montoya? Is that bad? She was loyal to Gordon. Police like that can't be trusted. Mm. 
They can't trust the peop the cops who were loyal to Gordon. She say more? Apparently not. Can they see me? No. Recording disabled. I should be able to turn that back on, that recording back on. <laughs> hey, Cap. I really wish I could turn that recording back on so that those two could get fucking fired. Okay, so that door can open, that one cannot. This Operational services. And more interview rooms. Let me make sure they didn't kill this person. Oh, they're breathing. All right. Holding cells. shoulder shut up or I'm coming in it fell off and then I ate it keep that crap to yourself weirdo you still got Betsy I need to that's a lot of ammo Ammo. The decommissioned bat signal. No Gordon, no Batman. No need for a bat signal. Bat signal was how the late James, uh, James Gordon summoned Batman to GCPD HQ. Even as time went on and the relationship developed beyond the need for it, Jim would still use it as a symbol. He used he used to say it was a promise to the people of Gotham City that Batman was out there, that they were protected. He also called it a warning, a dare almost, to the city's underworld. Just try something and see what happens. Uh, following Jim's passing, new commissioner Catherine Kane had the bat signal removed from the roof and submitted into evidence. Evidence 0408B, stolen diamond. Suspect Selena Kyle, AKA Catwoman. I heard Selena got busted during her last heist. Wonder how many lives Catwoman has left. Fi filing notes, several pounds of diamonds stolen from GC uh, uh, jewelers in Old Gotham in a heist, one of several suspected 
who have been performed by the serial cat burglar, Selena Kyle. Ceremonial costume suspect unknown. This belonged to Ray Shao Ghoul. Wonder where the rest of them got to. Filing note: Ceremonial garb found on unidentified body recovered from Wayne Manor ruins includes cape and several ten karat gold detailing. Uh, the costume appears to be quite old and is likely worth thousands. Knowing Ray, she was probably worth millions. Oh. Scarface, Peyton Riley, a.k.a. Ventriloquist. Nope. Nope. He just says nope. <laughs> nope. Uh, wooden ventriloquist dummy known as Scarface seized, seized from Peyton Riley, the daughter of Irish mob heavyweight Sean Riley. Peyton Riley claims innocence for all charges against her, stating it was the dummy who actually who is actually at fault. This includes two homicides. Yeah. Yep, yep. All right. Gains a variety of useful items. Don't mind if I do. What'd it give me? Hello? Are you not going to tell me what I just got? Fine then. Don't tell me. Meanies. I love that he listens at the door before pushing him open. The morgue somewhere on the other side of this bullpen. Now Security cameras. Particularly bad time to be spotted. Security cameras can alert nearby enemies to your location. Trigger reinforcements or activate other security measures. Use AR to search for a nearby control panel. Use the control panel to deactivate the camera. Oh wow, that's not just a camera. Okay. Come on. Nightwing, climb the dam. There you go. I barely hit that kid. Not my fault he tripped and hit the curb. A cab. All right. Yeah, goddamn parents. See something purple over there. Good thing he's got some big purple there. The lawyers will use that. No, Nothing. Accident. GCPD's finest, everybody. Ugh. Nothing. Oh, don't see me. <laughs> Darn. And I can't just reload. Fine. Coppers. Fuck the police. That was not what I wanted. Wow, you guys have fucking cannons.
And you're historically useless without us. Well, not really. Useless is strong. Red Hood's file. They make him sound so scary. <laughs> the criminal known as Red Hood is the prime suspect of the executions of several other criminals, each involved in major crimes. Statistically, he's responsible for more hospitalizations than anyone in Batman's gang. Proving Batman's methods are inconsistent, and his moral high ground is for show. Working theory is Red Hood works as the group's fixer, when brutality is required to solve problems. His combat efficiency suggests military training. Do not engage alone. <laughs> okay, uh, that's a no on the military training. That was Batman training. Um, also, no on the fixer. And the executions because he disagreed with Batman's methods. I feel like Red Hood would see that and be like, <laughs> I approve. <laughs> you know? Like Toph seeing uh, the Ember Islands, well, hearing about the Ember Islands version of her. Here's one. Robin. <laughs> Police file on Robin that repeatedly calls the boy Wonder a sidekick. Some of this early stuff on Robin is about me. Weird to think about. Yeah, because they wouldn't know that Robin is two different. <clears throat> well, three different people at this point. Uh, the unidentified vigilante Robin is connected to Batman on countless cases going as far back as Tony Zuko's arrest. He appears to be male, still younger than 18 despite his age. Uh, Robin is a formidable fighter with a high level of intelligence and investigative abilities rivaling his mentor. We currently don't know if the parents or legal guardians have any idea this boy risks his life as Batman's tactical support sidekick. Regardless, GCPD intends to try him as an adult accomplice. <laughs> oh man, I feel like both that I feel like Tim and uh Jason would both look at that and be like, <laughs> Ooh, mine. Nightwing. Let's go. Hell of a file on me. I'm almost flattered. <clears throat> Vigilante activity alias Nightwing. The Vigilante Nightwing was known to have headquarters in Bloodhaven until recently. He seems to have Bloodhaven being the sister city of Gotham City, not that far away from it. He seems to have made friends with BPD. Evidently, there's a charm to him. Lieutenant Sovoboda. Savaboda. 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 Assures us she's building a task force to identify collaborator collaborators within BPD ranks. Nightwing's impressive acrobatic prowess makes apprehending the suspect a difficult proposition. He's also responsible for. Uh, more GC and Gotham City incarcerations than any vigilante aside uh, besides the currently absent Dark Knight himself. And where's Bar uh, Batgirls? Batgirl. They clearly have no idea who she is. Which is for the best. Because if they knew that Barbara Gordon was Batgirl there would be a problem. <clears throat> the vigilante called Batgirl exhibits a fluid combat style based on security footage and eyewitness accounts possibly suggests a dancer background. Don't think so. Uh, could be wrong. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think Barbara Gordon has a dancer background. Um, we've pulled, pulled admissions records from several prominent art schools to determine uh, potential suspects. Batgirl is also intimately familiar with police procedure as well as ongoing investigations. A related theory is that Batgirl is a GCPD officer frustrated by red tape and protocol. Internal review is pending. I mean, they're not technically wrong. So just, she's just not an officer. All right. All right, where's that panel? There's that panel. No, 
honor of all who serves. That, that feels like a fire hazard. That feels like a fire hazard, having them leaning against the heaters like that. All right, well, I didn't mean to fight them. So where am I going? Over there, okay. So what's up here? Can you tell me what's in you? Okay. Cool. I love his little slide. Over here. Nothing? Nothing. Alright. Figures it's locked. Guessing a higher clearance. Someone must have a key. The desk sergeant, perhaps. <laughs> there you are. Good to see ya! Glad you could make it! How you doing? How you doing, Ursa? Whoa. Did someone knock out the forensics team? I'll give you one guess, too. Unconscious is good. Whew, not dead. Uh, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, what did you miss? Um, well, we had this epic cinematic that started the game that was Batman versus Raish and ended with Batman blowing up the cave and uh, Wayne Manor. This really touching funeral service for Bruce Wayne, uh, the Bat family mourning him and having some really adorable moments. Uh, and them cur they're, they're currently trying to... Uh, catch up on Batman's last uh, case to try to solve who killed him or why he died and stuff like that. And it led them to Kirk Langstrom, who is dead. And they have a hard drive that needs some... that has, like, a biometric lock of some kind, so they need uh, the key from Langstrom's corpse, which is... so we've been sneaking into the GCPD to get that corpse. And at the same time... Ra's al Ghul, who killed Batman or killed Bruce Wayne and Batman, uh, is in the morgue as well. Well, they know they know Ra's was there. Um, the the Bat family does. That I just don't think they know why. And I think they think that it's connected to their uh, to Bruce's last case. Um, and uh, it's unclear exactly what they know and what they don't know at this point. But they did specifically say that they knew Raish was there fighting Bruce. Um, and uh, yeah. I guess Talia or Nissa. Belfry, Talia Uncle is here. Talia. Great. Be careful. You know you can't beat me. 
My beloved has trained you. Right. Pretty sure he told you to stay out of Gotham. Dead men's wishes don't concern me. Besides, I'm here to clean up my father's mess. Which in this case is the demon himself. You're just burning him? Might be hard to bring Raish back if he's Ash Talia. Even a Lazarus pit has some limits. Wait. Why was he after Bruce? Oh, you also missed me do a little bit of um, costume customization on Nightwing. Uh, the default is this, and eh, I, it's not. I'm not a fan of it. So we swapped to a different suit and did some modifications to it. Exactly. That that she threw at you like a fucking kunai. Uh, something tells me Raish isn't coming back this time. Well, I mean, he's come. He, I think he canonically has come back from worse than being cremated. So maybe. <laughs> Langstrom. Hopefully the ME found something. You're looking for a bio decryption key. So a bio decryption key, that's what it was. Powered by genetic material. Prime scene AR. A urine sample. I don't think I don't think he peed on a hard drive. For measuring glucose in the blood. Did Langstrom have diabetes? I feel like the stabbing was like a like I think maybe she took like a like as a final last you bastard thing. Cause Talia and Raish, they it was always a very complicated relationship between them. All right. Weathered wallet overloaded with receipts and fast food loyalty cards. Imagine being allergic to something as delicious as seafood. <laughs> While an employee file at Gotham University also lists diabetes under uh, Langstrom's known health conditions, diabetes does not appear on Langstrom's medical bracelet. It is possible that Langstrom lied to the university about having diabetes. Interesting. Is this for playing a game online? An MMO key fob! <laughs> nice! A limited edition key fob used with a popular massive MM uh, MMORPG Authenticator apps have made these devices more or less obsolete. Yeah, Star Wars: The Old Republic has one or had one. It's amazing, you can read oxygen through a finger. Pulse oximeter. This portable device uses a finger to measure blood pressure and the level of oxygen carried in blood, red blood cells. Pulse oximeters are generally used by individuals with persistent health issues or by those recovering from certain surgeries and illnesses. Langstrom's phone. That's not a phone. That's a tablet. Holy shit, that thing's massive. There's a USB plug concealed in the base of the blood glucometer. The device appears to have been modified, so it is probably that, but... True! Or the blood is needed for bringing him back. That's very fair. Urine. Again, hopefully not. Coroner tools, uh, tools for performing an autopsy. Seems they opted not to perform a full examination. It appears that Langstrom died slowly and painfully, cranial bruising and swelling 
uh, multiple stab wounds on his arms and legs. Some wounds pierced through him, making it possible to pin his body to the wall. There are also precise knife wounds in the chest and head, at least one being the likely cause of death. I wonder if the GCPD has my prints on file. They would probably figure out who you were by now. Uh, if that was the case. Fingerprint kit. The medical examiner took fingerprints from Langstrom's hands post-mortem standard procedure during a suspicious death. Blood would definitely also in be Gotham. For bio decryption. Totally not assassin behavior at all. No, totally not. Uh, likely the outfit Angstrom was wearing when he died. Fresh blood, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Yep. All right. He hit the data in a glucose meter that reads his blood. Belfry, GCPD just figured out Talia's been here. I need a way out. I'm on it. We'll find you an exit. Be careful. These guys are armed to the teeth. Thankfully, I know my way around the GCPD systems. Sorry to leave you guys in the dark. Just a second. I'll answer your question in a second. Just a second. Um, if you're in the Discord, uh, your, your voice will come through the stream. Uh, you'll be able to hear me. Um, I mean, I can turn off. If you would rather not come through, I can mute the Discord in OBS so that you don't come through. But it is by default set up that uh, your voice would come through the uh, through or should come through uh, my stream. Uh, so, like, if you want me to, I can mute. I I can. Uh, Mute Discord in OBS so that it doesn't come through. But by default, it does come through. How much do you care? I mean, that's up to you. Oh, you're good. Also, if you want to, uh, if you want to have the game audio go through Discord, I can set that up too. It's not again, not by default, but yeah. Basically, I'd just be sharing my screen. I'm sneaking out of here. Another unconscious person. This uh, one, not my fault. Entrance is secure. Spread out. We'll find the perp. Keep going. They gotta be here somewhere. Avoid fighting GCPD. They don't offer rewards. Nope. You saw nothing. Alright, so while they're over there, I will pop out. Ooh, hi. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. You're fine. Got an officer down! Belfry, all clear to exit the station. Thanks for the assist. Anytime. Looking forward to seeing what you found. Get out of the shadows and give yourself up. I ain't in there. Belfry, the GCPD found me. 
need to be careful, sir. It really wouldn't do to chip the paint on the bat cycle this quickly. No, we don't want that. <laughs> That's what I'm looking for. There we go. Return to the Belfry to end your evening patrol. You can physically travel to the Belfry or use its fast travel point. Okay. Immediate access. Okay. Prime stopped zero, technically. All right. All right. Okay, lab notes, formulas, financial records, research into hearing loss, human experimentation and trials? That looks like cash payouts and volunteers. I recognize some of these. Oh no! Jerks. They're all known gang members. So Langston oh, was doing Alfred. medical experiments on criminals. You're crowding me. Miss Gordon. The hollow imaging system is back online as of this morning. Perfect timing, Alfred. Hey, I forgot how sweet your setup was, Babs. It's ancient, but it'll do for now. You and Master Bruce are the only two people in the entire world who would consider the Belfry systems ancient. While researching Langstrom, I also called up all we've got on our party crasher. Talia Al Ghul. She was a match for Master Bruce in more ways than one. Her presence in Gotham is concerning. So is the fact that she torched her old man's body. We sure that was Ra's al Ghul? His DNA was all over the weapon she left behind. I wonder why she didn't take a chance and use a Lazarus pit to revive him. Well, Batman would just find Talia and ask her himself. Good thinking. Yeah, I can double check Talia's kunai for trace materials that we can track. We should also hit the streets, find out if anyone had any beef with Langstrom. Sweet. Time to bust some skulls. Oh, Alfred. Uh, I said that because... There's new data on the... Hold that thought, game. Uh, I said it because he's still mourning the loss of Bruce and still having to take care of these kids, you know? <laughs> but also, he saw that look was such a proud papa look as he was walking away from them. Right? Right? The one, the only thing that I have really disliked about the voice acting so far <coughs> is that Bruce was not voiced by Kevin Conroy. And like, he was, I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly, he was still alive when they were recording the Bruce Wayne vo voice lines to this game. But I could be wrong. I don't know. He may not have been up to it. But at the very least, it makes me sad but all the rest of it it's been great okay uh let's see here. let's kind of catch up catch up on chat cat got into cheesecake yikes cat's okay yeah it, it yeah. <laughs> um and all I said was um, about the Discord thing was if you want to pop in, you can. If you don't want your voice on stream, I can mute the Discord through OBS. Um, and if you want the game to come in through the Discord, oh, hi. If you want the game to come in through the Discord, I can share my screen.
So, yeah. Okay, I had to pause your Twitch because you are way behind where you are in Discord. Yeah, Twitch has a massive delay. So, so that's what should I do? The other thing. Would you like me to share my game, uh, my stream in the Discord, my my game in the yeah, Discord, that would so you can probably help. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. Share screen. It's going to be a lower resolution, blah, 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 blah. Okay. But it's there. Okay. Here we go. Okay. All right. And did you want me to mute you in the OBS? Uh, nah, it's fine. Okie day. All right. Okay. I can't get over what Talia did to her father's body. Good riddance. Going in a Lazarus pit once is hell. Who knows Here what a thousand okay. dunk would have done to him. So you mm. think it really was a show of mercy? Oh, she was putting on a show, all right. But I doubt it was mercy. Agreed. I don't think that it was a show of mercy. But she was definitely putting on a show. A I will bit. examine the evidence boards in a bit. Um. Oh, Alfred. Let's see here. Oh, the bat cycle. Customization of the bat cycle. Yes, please. <laughs> oh my god, I can make it pink and blue. Oh god. Out of somewhere, our friend's ears start burning. Right? In every universe of the 52, Bruce rolls over in his grave. <laughs> there are some decent color schemes in here. Um, none of which you I, have yet? No, none of them I have unlocked, but... Um, but they're ones I can what? keep an eye on. Um, I think the one that's mainly black with red accents is the one I'm going to want to go for. Um, but anyway. All right. It's up here. I wonder how much of the game I actually get to do running around as actual Dick Grayson and them rather than just in costume. I can play an arcade game? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god! As somewhere Alfred says, I don't think this is quite the uh, time for that. It's okay, Alfred. We all gotta, we all gotta unwind every now and then. I get a new life. Okay. Well, I think you just took out one of the top cars. Yep. Okay, so you can't cross over from one to the other. Good to know. Gotta love mediums, right? Right.
Bridge out detour on left. Good to know. Okay, I'm done. Of, uh, <laughs> hit the stuff too many times. Yeah. Ooh. Forensic investigation. Someone's watching the news. This is GCN. I'm Lee Rashid. That's a big TV, and I'm here for it. Being rich is a thing. Right? Okay. All right. So we examined the relaxation corner. Oh, they have a little memorial to Bruce with the bits of his, his suit that they were able to recover. The remnants of his cape, the remnants of his gauntlet, and the remnants Bruce of his cowl. Bruce never mentioned Langstrom's name to you? Not once, Master Richard. He had a variety of cases he kept from me, but never one this important. We'll figure it out. Of that, sir, I have no doubts. And we will do it together. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's like a wheelchair elevator. <laughs> well, I mean... Handicap accessible is the thing. They have a kitchenette. I love that they have a kitchenette. Oh my god! Yep, there's, that's an there, thing. There's a chef's apron with the Wonder Woman symbol on it. <laughs> Gee, any chance it's actually Jason's? Any chance it's actually hers? as a pillar in Gotham's business community. Wayne chaired the Martha Wayne Foundation, and he was often lauded for growing his family business into one of the city's most valuable companies, with interests in everything from medical technology to shipping and aeronautics. I think I speak for many in Gotham when I say Wayne will be sorely missed. This is Noor Rashid with GCN. All right. Character selection. You can change your character at the Belfry between patrols. Okay. They level up in sync. That's good. Uh, we'll swap to Jason for a second. He's a big burly man. We're swapping to Jason because Jamie wants to try to, to customize his outfit. Nah. Will it let me? Where do you have to go to do that? Uh, well, it was in the menu. Here we go. Will it? No? Okay. He does the awkward run, too. Yeah. Yeah, he does. I think it's a video game thing. I wasn't paying attention if, um, Dick if... was doing it, too, though. Well, let's see. Does she do it? Nah, she looks normal. She's just tilted. The other ones look like they hunch their shoulders funny. It's like they well, don't motion know what capture. to do with It's like they don't know what to do with muscle men shoulders. Right. Like don't Does you he know do it? when muscle men run they keep their shoulders up funky. Does he do it? The others tell me that the bat uh, is down not as bad. But that's why I'm and kind I'm of it. leaning towards maybe it's the muscle. We don't know how to art that. <laughs> He was the same as they have to hunch instead, hunch over instead of lean. To many on the force right. He was. Also, can we Never talk about the fact? Mad. Can we talk about the yeah. fact that their models have, their mannequins have, fucking hair? <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to make it obvious for the player, man. Right, in case the outfit <laughs> didn't do it. <laughs> in case you didn't catch it.
The evidence boards track information discovered during your investigation. The lead section features the most relevant information about your next steps, highlight evidence, gain information about the next steps of your investigation. Tap Q to quickly access the challenge menu. Why do I need to? Okay, it doesn't, okay. Uh, evidence board, let's see here. Previous intel found an article about the fire at Gotham University. A fire broke out at around 11.30 last night. No casualties were reported by the GCFD. Part of the university will remain closed until the fire department and authorities can inspect and clear the site. Police seem to be downplaying the freaks' involvement in the fire, and there's no mention of Langstrom's murder either. Okay. Gotham Gazette wrote an article on Bruce's death. It says billionaire philanthropist Bruce Wayne, chairman of Wayne Enterprises, was found dead in his Palisades mansion after it collapsed Sunday. Police are investigating. Thankfully, neither the police nor the press are pushing to uncover the real reason for the collapse. They also remain unaware that something was hidden underneath the manor. Yeah, a big something. Uh, Raish was in the Batcave with Bruce when it collapsed. We might never know why he was there to begin with. We encountered Talia at the GCPD morgue. She burned Raish's body. The DNA on the kunai she left behind confirmed it was him. She didn't even try to revive him in a Lazarus pit. Now that he's gone for good, there's no telling what she or the League of Shadows will do next. Ali Al Ghul, daughter of Raish Al Ghul, the demon's head, and next in line as the lead of the, as the leader of the League of Shadows. Until Raish passed her over in favor of naming Bruce as his heir. The last time Bruce faced Talia, he told her to never return to Gotham. Now that he's gone, she's decided to come back. Great. <laughs> I love that it actually I, I love that it actually just says, great. <laughs> like, they wrote that into their intel sheet. She's come back. Yeah. Great. <laughs> or at least as long as she needed for that particular five second thing. True. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Batman was investigating a doctor by the name of Kirk Langstrom. He's, he suspected our good professor was performing unsanctioned experiments, but never got a chance to look deeper into it before he died. Priority Intel. Langstrom's hard drive contained records of human bio reengineering experiments he was conducting on criminals. What he was trying to accomplish is still unclear, but it was all definitely illegal, judging by how hard he worked to keep it secret. He hid the bio decryption key in a glucometer or glucometer, whatever, um, that had to be unlocked with a sample of his blood. Talk about tight security. Langstrom was killed in his lab, then pinned to a wall. Somehow the police, somehow the police ruled it an accident. <laughs> Even though all the evidence points to murder. Hmm. Yes, this man is pinned to the wall by an assassin's sword. Hmm. Definitely an accident. <laughs> uh, there were also strange scratches in the lab in the office. Um, not sure what caused them. Okay. And leads. We don't have a lead on Dr. Langstrom's killer, but maybe some of his volunteers know something. We're going to track them down. Okay. The freaks claim Robinson's Park, the Robinson Park as their territory. Once in the area, use your compass or AR to find criminal informants. Interrogate freaks to find out more information. Okay. And we have to interrogate the mob for more information as well. Okay. Those are our two challenges. Oh, let me go over to the gear. It won't let me go over to the gear. Okay, fine. I have to use uh, my momentum abilities. Uh, I have to defeat five of these big shielded screw fuckers. Um, basic training. Okay. Crafting. Okay. All right. Let's do some training. Say, Babs, that was good work with Langstrom's drive. I'm not 
getting under your skin, am I? You gotta hand it to me. That was funny. No. Physical and mental preparation go hand in hand. Here, we can train the mind to ah, prepare the body, I see. but it requires deep focus. Let go of your self-doubt and focus on my voice. Yeah, not Conroy. Voice no. actor's doing a good job, don't get me wrong, but he's not Conroy. The other person in the room said, uh, not mind control at all. Yeah. Hold X to scan criminals and locate the informant. Grab informants to interrogate them, reduce their HP, or approach from stealth to get them talking. All right, which one are you use the... Oh, you are, okay. Spill it, pal. Ugh, you got beautiful hands. Look, I'll tell you what you want to know. We're friends. Just what I need to know. That wasn't over the top at all. Nope. Unaware, stunned, low on health, or affected by certain knockdowns. I need to know. Oh, whatever. Those freaks say nothing to me. Here's what I know. Thank you. I expect no less. So, is he knocking them out or are you? Uh, it's an automatic thing after you interrogate. Oh, okay. Grabbing enemies. You can grab enemies who are unaware, stunned, low on health, or affected by certain knockdowns. Hey, man. Oops. Were you supposed to interrogate? No. This is just... Uh, it's teaching me how to grab. And all the things I can do once I've got them grabbed. So once I've got them grabbed, I can beat their face in. I can throw them against things. Or I can throw them over ledges. Maybe. Well, it says I can. There we go. Oops, that was the wrong button. <laughs> Don't mind me, I just accidentally, sh you know, shot something in the- oops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, that's what I meant to do. He's got these little, uh, ballistic darts that he could fire. Alright, now. Now. Sure, I'll take that. You got on my bad side. Okay. Sure I did. Oh. I can't use the ability I wanted to use. Okay, fine. Okay, grab. And throw. Good. Yay. Don't get him off after him. Right? All right, so we've done that. Now we do stealth. Stealth. Silent takedown is a slow and quiet method that doesn't draw enemy attention. Ambush takedown is faster and louder. Best for quickly dispatching a foe before fighting the rest. Go to sleep. Oh, that looks painful. 
like I felt that in my groin. Holy shit. <laughs> Nightwing made him do a split fall onto the corner of that thing. I felt that. Oh. Come on. Peek your head out. Don't turn around, you turn around. We'll take it though. And now it's dealer's choice. You're ready to move on. Sharpen your basic combat skills against this opponent. Yeah, let's give you a little bit of room. Let's I feel bad having you pinned in the corner like that. I mean, it's just a simulation. Yeah. Something 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 honorable blah 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 blah. Unless I was too the I don't suppose you'd let me go. When an Dark enemy blocks your attack, break through their defenses with a heavy strike. Okay, Ralph, calm down. Get complacent. <laughs> Fire headshots using precision aim, perform standard range attacks, and perform heavy range attacks. if you actually face the guy. Right. There we go. You're ready to move on. When in combat, use the smoke bomb to grapple out of combat and return to stealth. 
Hold F to throw smoke bombs. Okay. Hi guys. What's up? Oh, that didn't work. all of those let's do some momentum training Okay, continue training. All right, that was momentum. Advanced training, perfect evade. Which is what I was already doing, but. Time your dodge to create an opening for a powerful counterattack. There's gonna be one last. Too soon. Come on. She got airtime on that one. Oop, too soon. One more, because I mistimed it before. There we go. As expected. Well, well done. done. All right. So do I not have any more at the moment? Doesn't Looks seem to like be. No. Yep. I'm proud okay. of you, Dick. Oh, my heart! I'll be right back. Yes, dear. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay. Know what this place needs. <laughs> A cat. Listen, Grayson. If you're scared of some mouse you saw scurrying, I'll keep you safe. Very funny. But, uh, yeah, I, I definitely did. So, cat? <laughs> oh, man! Ursa's gonna be so sad she missed that. Okay, what is this? Newspaper looks like. Sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night, expecting Bruce to call me for help. And 
then I remember. I thought it might have been one of you calling just now. I was worried. <laughs> Old habits, I suppose. That's why I thought going to Bloodhaven alone would be easier. But it wasn't. I won't be like him, Alfred. Bruce left some big shoes to fill. But I'm gonna do things my way. And I'll be here to support you. Gotham is in good hands. Dick was always meant to be the better Batman. Always meant to be. Gotham City needs a new guardian. Complete knighthood challenges to unlock powerful new abilities for each hero, including the unique hero travel. Heroic travel. Oh my god, he gets a glider. <laughs> oh, and she gets the cape like uh the cape glide like um Batman had in the Arkham games. Okay, track challenges in the in the challenge tab, okay. Oh, well, that was a sweet moment with uh with uh Alfred. Let's see here. Ooh, I can craft a melee thing, but it's not better than what I already have. Okay. Oh, will it actually let me change? Okay, hold up. If it'll actually let me change now. Um... All right. You feeling okay? Yeah, buddy. Why? Just, you know, from behind, you've been looking a bit different. Wondering if you weren't working out as much. How dare you? <laughs> well, you are getting old. What? I am not. I'm only... Wait, Babs, am I old? Dick, he's being a jerk. Your butt is fine. <laughs> fine? Fine? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing! <laughs> Perfection. Perfection. Alright, load out. Suits. Ooh. Alright. I prefer the suit, the version of the suit that has a jacket, but I don't think I can get that yet. Um, if at all, let's see here. <laughs> that one comes with a vest. There we go. Year one. That's kind of the one I like. I'm not sure about the shirt, though. And for the tier metal metal. Um, I like the metal outfit, though. Beyond Night Ops Shinobi Night Watch. I think Night Watch is uh, the one I'm gonna use for him. Cause I like that. I like that that look. Okay. Um, welcome back. You missed a couple of adorable moments. Okay. Um, there was a conversation with Dick and Alfred about how Alfred uh, still wakes up at night thinking, uh, expecting to hear Bruce calling for help and then remembering and how his phone, he panicked just then with, when his phone was ringing because he thought it might have been one of them calling him and he couldn't find his phone um and then nick uh, and then nick 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 nickelodeon um and then dick re encouraging him 
Okay. Um, and I thought you did you like the one with the jacket? I I'm getting to that. Ah, okay. Because it's you. There's so the way this works is there's your loadout, which is your equipment, and then ah. you can on top of that change how you ah. look. Ah. Ooh, I like the gotcha. knighthood one. Ooh. Okay. Talon's a little yeah. weird. Yeah, ta Talon, I mean, Talon is just Talon, it's just Talon. So, but yeah. Yeah, I think I'm going to apply that transmog, but um, the unfortunate thing is that the transmogs can't be customized. Um, which is why I was uh, just looking to see what, there we go what options I had here. Oh my god, what color options do I have here? Get all white. Ultra Zurin R. Oh, there's his color scheme from Asylum. From Arkham Asylum. Uh... Gotta have the spikes, but... Yeah, no, we're, we're we're swapping over to uh Nightwatch. Cuz I actually like that uh, that appearance. Um But uh also there was a Dick came uh Dick made a comment about uh suggesting that the um that they get a cat for the for the Belfry and um Jason was just like, look, if you're scared because of a mouse you found, I'll protect you. And Dick's just like, ha ha. Okay, but seriously, though, I did. Can, can we get a cat? <laughs> um, but then there was also when I swapped to Jason, I don't know if you were here for it or not, but there, there, Jason was like, you've been looking a little bit different from behind, Grayson. I was just worried. I'm worried that you're not working out as much. Because, I mean, you are getting old. And Dick's just like, what? No, I work out. Babs, tell him. And Babs is like, don't worry, J Dick. Your butt looks great. <laughs> Actually, oh, no, she doesn't say great. She says fine. She says fine. And he goes, fine? Fine? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm loving their banter. The banter is all I ever needed from this game. Like, if I'm honest. Right. right. <laughs> you know what you need, Nightwing? Come on. No, don't say it. A cape. <laughs> Shameful. It's in the name, man. Nightwing. Get a cape. What are you two arguing about? Dick was just saying Nightwing needed a cape. Splendid idea, Master Richard. It is implicit in the name, after all. <laughs> I'm just gonna spend 12 hours listening to their banter. Um, this is fine. We're all fine here now. Thank you. Oh wow. Oh wow. They they didn't go half. They didn't go half ass on her on her Beyond suit at all. Shit. <laughs> Damn. All right. Let's see what we got. The Arkham Asylum color scheme she had. Um, well, not Asylum, but Arkham Knight color scheme. Is it Renar? Okay. Oh wait, not that. Mm. Honestly, I think I like that one better than that one. That one reminds me of Cassandra. Oop, whoa, let's not be staring at her boobies. Thank you. Um, I, that one reminds me of Cassandra Kane's bat uh, bat girl suit. A little bit. 
All right, we're going to be looking at her boobs, but only looking at the at the symbol, I promise. Respectfully, respectfully. We're being respectful. All right. <laughs> We've moved on. All right. Now, moving on to the transmogs, because I don't think I'm wanting to keep that. Um, so, new guard. Eh. Titan. Ooh, I like that one. I like that one. I have, to, I have to unlock that one, though. Eternal. Little classic. Year one. Nice. Neon noir. Demon. Dang. Privateer. Metal. I'm going to do that every time I get to the metal one. Beyond. Night Ops. Shinobi. Nightwatch. I think Nightwatch is the one I'm going to go with, because that's the one that reminds me the most of the comics. Though I will say her default one does have elements reminiscent of my favorite Batgirl suit, which is the one designed by Babstar. But I think at least until I get... Um, Nighthood's not bad, but at least until I get the... Where was it? The Titan one, I think I'm going to stick with the the Night Watch. Okay. All right, Robin, you're up. Hey, Drake, what you got? Get off the... There you go. Geometry. Float out. Suit. Beyond suit. Oh, dang! Wow, they really did go in on the... On the uh, Beyond suits. They're all really well done. <laughs> like, they could be better, but like, you know, as far as like Batman Beyond style is concerned, they're not bad. Um, let's see your styles. All right. The Arkham Asylum color scheme. Wow, it really, it really just inverted his whole deal. Dang. Zarenar. All right. Uh, cowl options. Ooh. I think I like that one for the. You know the what's funny? Is it beyond. just me, or is that one for some reason reminding me of a movie? It is. It very much is. In fact, that's what I expected for the, uh, for the, the God, what is it? The, the Beyond Robin suit was. I expected it to be very reminiscent of the, um, the uh -huh. Joel Schumacher Batman and Robin movie. Uh -huh. um with uh george clooney and uh -huh. chris o'donnell um because it is because you know whenever people like fan arted out the batman beyond nightwing or robin outfit it was always always based off of that design in fact in that movie the design of that suit was actually kind of nightwing based more than robin it's just that they the script writers didn't get the the memo or they couldn't clear the usage of the name or something. Um, but in fact, actually quickly popping over to the Nightwing one, you can actually see in the Nightwing Beyond suit the elements of that Robin, uh, that Robin suit from that movie. So, like, they did utilize some inspiration for it, but more for Nightwing than for uh, Robin. Which kind of makes sense because, you know, Dick Grayson rather than... Actually, with the mask being, like, with it being that mask instead of the other one, the full face mask, I don't hate that. You know? Yeah. 
and, and even with that i don't hate it but like this one this one just looks kind of scary it's like too spider-man yeah that's the word i'm looking for spider -Man. it's very spider-man or at least very spider <laughs> right right fair yes so like that look i don't hate and even again even that look i don't hate but like that one's obviously uh, my preferred. That's probably because we're too used to uh, Jason's helmet. Ye true. Very good point. <laughs> Very good point. But that said, oh god, I keep pushing the wrong buttons. That said, let's see what they have here. So there's the. I do not. I do not like the Robin suit in this in this game. He's got a poncho looking thing, you know. And, and it's yeah like, I don't, I it's don't little... like it Meh. like I, I don't mind the hood I've never minded Robin with a hood um but the cape sure. the cape goes unnoticed because it's because of the front that front is severely distracting so I'm not a fan of that design ooh the Titan suits I'm not I'm not sure how I feel about the cowl but it is the, it does feel very red Robin e. That's Ish. one of those things that if you were able to change out the 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 the, the, the cowl, cowl or the other one, it probably would look really good still. Oh, absolutely, it would be perfect if if I could take the 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 mask that he that I have currently set for the for this one and put it on that though maybe black instead of red, that would be perfect. Eternal, which, as you can see, actually is using his red Robin symbol rather than the the normal Robin symbol. So, like, that right. tracks with red Robin. Ooh! Okay! We're going for hanging out with Jason. Right? Like, I don't hate it, though. I do. I, I, I love that jacket. I love that jacket. Oh, God. I like the mask. The color scheme use, could use a little work. <laughs> Ooh, demon. Privateer. Ooh, I like that. I like the privateer look. All of the privateer outfits have been completely on point. Is it privateer Metal. or privateer? I think it can be pronounced either way. I think technically, I think it is privateer, but I go uh, privateer okay. because I'm being fancy. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> metal. Um, I like. I do like the metal suit, um, though. I like that it has the three yellow bars down the chest, which were which are reference to the classic Robin outfit because he had like these weird stitches or something down his chest that were holding that was supposed to be like holding the suit together like buttons almost it, so I like that reference there's a couple of vibes from it that I'm not I don't sure like of. the majority green I don't like the majority Correct. green that's one of the things I was thinking of the other thing was his the, <laughs> the fingers coming down his face right that's that's fair <laughs> Those are the, two uh, the prop in my mind. I wonder if maybe this other greenish, the greenish accent, like on his fingers and on his waist and shoulders, if we swapped the the greener green and the faded green, so that it looked a bit more like a grayish green as the main body. Maybe. I think I wonder if maybe that would look better because I don't want to swap it to red as the primary because then I because I like this chest piece. I really do like this chest piece, and I feel like that would get lost if the whole thing was red. Black could work, though. True, black could work. But I do also like the green, because the traditional suit is red and green and yellow. Sure. Although his Red Robin one is not. That's true. That is very true. But anyway. Moving on. Now the standard Beyond one. I do like that they used his used that mask for him, rather as the default for the Beyond rather than the others. Um, Night Ops, wow, that's some. Hi, I'm totally not Jason Todd. 
gonna also say totally not Assassin's Creed. Very true. Oh no, no, this one's the Assassin's Creed one. <laughs> In the snow. Yep. That's the one. That's the one I'm using. Okay. Yeah. That moment when he just died. <laughs> Although, Raider is also really nice. But I think for now I'm using this one. What's funny is I think I'm using the Night Watch on all of them, except for maybe Barbara's. Huh. On Barbara's was was I using Night Watch on Barbara's? I'm gonna go look. So I don't remember. Wait, no, yes. I thought you said the I thought you said he was not Night Watch. Well, right, right. On Dix is absolutely not Night Watch. But I was no, I couldn't no, no. remember if No, T Tim's. Tim's if you're is going Night with Watch. the green one. This one's Night Watch. It is? Yeah. I thought Night Watch was the Oh, I'm getting so confused by the names. <laughs> <laughs> one moment. Night Watch. Oh. Okay. Which one were you thinking it was? I think it was the night ops got me confused because it's still. Oh yeah, they it. also have knighthood. They have knighthood, night ops, night yeah. Okay, that's not confusing or anything. Okay. Yeah, no. Totally not. So yeah, is I think that I all three of them are night watch. And I, I kind of, I kind of gotta use Nightwatch on on Nightwing now though, because the only reason I didn't was because I liked the Beyond suit a slight, a tad bit better. But like, you know, I gotta use the set at this point, you know. So like, okay. And also, you're here now, so you can actually see them. New Guard, which is a variation of the default. Titan. I don't mind the Titan though; it's not my favorite. Uh, Eternal. Year one, Neon Noir, Demon, Privateer, Privateer, Metal. There's the Beyond one. And Night Ops. Night Ops, which again, also feels kind of Damien, actually. Like, this feels like an old Damian Wayne pretending to be Nightwing thing. Rather than an actual Dick Grayson. But anyway. Uh, Shinobi. Mesh of, mesh of the two eldest. Yeah, true. True, true, true. Shinobi. There's Nightwatch. Talon. And Knighthood. I don't mind the Knighthood one either. Um, and Raider. But... So here's Nightwatch. So... I pointed this out earlier. Whoever rendered his 3D model for Nightwatch really, yeah. really liked Dick Grayson. Really Ooh. liked Dick Grayson. Because he's... He is quite... No clue. ...well-armed. <laughs> he's definitely no got a concealed about. weapon on his being. No idea what you're talking about. What's funny, though, is they didn't give as much love to his ass as they did his package. So, yeah, we're going with Nightwatch for all of them. <laughs> okay. Although, I, uh, it's got the wingtips on the arms. I'm not sure. I don't like the wingtips. Oh. The, the where it's it goes down the arms. Down the arms. Yeah, where, where the color goes down the arms and onto the middle fingers, I don't like that. Like, I don't like, like, it's not, I don't want it to be just plain, but I don't think it should be an extension of the symbol on the chest. So go somewhat match with the other knight one. And unfortunately, I don't have the ability with these because they're transmog. Oh. You just take the out. You, now, when I get the when I actually get the 
components for these because that's a thing um when i get far enough in the game that i actually get like the actual suit parts for these different suits then i can absolutely do that i just need to get the the blueprints for it first but anyway all right so what were we doing craft a new melee weapon using the no i wasn't you said you didn't like the stripes ah but i can't change it without going off a night watch I like his hair on that watch, though. That's why I was though. asking about the other night one. Do you not have it what? yet? I don't... Oh. This one? Yeah, no, don't I don't have, have it. it. No. Uh, I only have a couple right. of them. Because it's, it's the definitive edition. These are the ones that come with it. New Guard, um, Beyond, and Night Watch are the only ones I got, that I have. Oh. Uh, but anyway. I'm going to just keep it anyway. Yeah, I'll make do. Oh. Um, so it wants me to craft a new melee weapon. Not that I really need it, but... Still not as strong as the one I have. Co-op multiplayer! You can now play cooperative multiplayer with other players. Tap C to access the social wheel to quickly change your online option. Tap P and select social to invite or join friends. <coughs> Uh, friends only. So, anyway. So, who should I go on patrol as tonight? I have already run around a decent bit as Dick. What do you think? Should I go out as Robin, Batgirl, or... Let's do Batgirl. Let's give Barbara a chance to stretch her legs so she's not cooped up in the belfry all night. I'm refraining from my joke. Stretching her legs? Uh-huh. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Look at it! It's actually crafting my Eskrima stick! Nice. Ooh, I have an email. So did he. Well, I think it's all shared, but yeah. Dinah Lance! Concert trip! To Barbara Gordon. Wait. Why? Holy shit! Hold on! Hold on! What?! <laughs> Dinah Lance, Barbara Gordon, Kara Danvers. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, why would we rent a car? That makes no sense. You can get us there in like two seconds for free. Being in a car with anyone for over 10 hours, no matter how much you love them, ends with you wanting to kill each other. I want to see the screaming dollies as much as anyone, but maybe we should just wait until they come here. Babs, back me up here. <coughs> From Kara. Okay, so a few things. A, I'm not a packing mule or a magic carpet. <laughs> you are not riding me to Montreal. <laughs> B, I'm fairly certain you couldn't kill me if you tried. <laughs> C, it'll be fun. I've never been on a road trip before. If you were my real friend, aww. Aww. Babs, back me up here. Aww. From Diana Prince. Hey, Wonder Woman. Come avenge the person that I ship you with. <clears throat> Barbara, I have been fortunate in my journeys to meet many remarkable women, but I have... Met few as strong-willed as yourself. Something like this isn't about strength, though. Be sure to give yourself some space to live in your feelings. And if you ever need someone to lean on, I'm here for you. You will get through this, Diana. Oh. <coughs> to all from Dick. Do you guys remember when Bruce hid batarangs all over the city for us to find so we could practice parkour? I don't think we ever found them all. What do you say we go on a treasure hunt? It'd be just like old times. Oh, that's a collectible thing. Um, Gotham Historical Circuit. So I had an idea. What the, there's these things called the Gotham Historical Circuit that takes you to all these cool spots around the city. What do you say we check them out? There's an app for it, but I replaced the data with Bruce's files just for us. Gotham Historical Circuit, here we come. New to Gotham City, fan of history, blah, 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 okay. 
Uh, I need help with my arts project. Okay, so I have a favor to ask for my arts class. I decided to do a project on street art, but I don't have the time to get everything I need for myself. So if you're out and see some cool graffiti, can you scan it for me? I'd really appreciate it. P.S. Did you know some historians consider cave paintings to be the first graffiti ever created? Which means this art form could potentially be tens of thousands of years old. I believe it. I wonder if their emails are different or if they're shared. Let's swap. I'm betting some of them are. Yeah. Dick, time for you to go check your email. Okay. So he's got the three that are to all, but he doesn't have any of his un of his own yet. Babs, however, got some from from uh, Diana, and Dinah, <laughs> and a few others. Wait, you didn't check Dix? I did. He had the oh. he had the three that were to all, but not any unique to him. Else. Oh, from yeah. Bart! From Bart! Drake, you you doing okay over there? If you want. You wanted to, oh, I, I could hear, I can hear, what's his name? Um, from, uh, from Young Justice, who play, who does Impulse. I can hear his voice. Oh, man. <coughs> uh, if you want to talk, I could be there before you finish reading the sentence, but I want to give you space if you need space. But if you don't, I could be there. Young Justice takes care of their own baby. <laughs> Did you know that if you hit a touchstone, a touch screen rapidly enough, it doesn't know what to do with the inputs and just freezes? Not bringing that up for any, per any reason in particular. Bye. <laughs> God, I love Bart. <laughs> and from Cassie. Tim, I know things are crazy right now, so I'll keep this short. The Titans send their love. Cyborg is a little pissed you won't return his calls, but he knows you need space. <coughs> Excuse me. I thought you might take uh, might like to take your mind off everything that's going on. Okay, that's a lie. I thought you might need to take your mind off every uh, uh okay that whoa, I thought you might need what am I what is happening? I thought you might like to take your mind off everything that's going on. Okay, that's a lie. I thought you might need to take your mind off everything that's going on. I'm there now, Cassie. I follow. Maybe we could speed run some escape rooms soon. Get you out of your cape for a bit. No pressure, though. I hope you're leaning on someone. This is a hell of a thing to be going through by yourself. I didn't really keep all the, uh, this all that short, huh? Oh, oh, friendship. I'm kind of salty that Nightwing didn't get any, though. <laughs> Like, not e not an email from Corey? Nothing? Jason didn't either. Huh. Huh. Well, fine. That's a bit more believable, actually. But, anyway. Yeah, okay, so back to Babs. And yes, I am aware that it is after 10, but I'm, I'm enjoying this so much, I'm just gonna keep going. Question. Do I have to do it with all of them? No. Thank God I don't. Thank <laughs> God I do not. <laughs> they said that they level up together, so I would think. Yeah, the same well. Time as it would be nice to sometimes have different moves. I think they do have different. Some different moves. Yeah. So, like, they have different trees and stuff, but they don't have different. Um. They have different momentum abilities. Um. But they don't have, uh, di but yeah, all the missions are the same. Okay, so I do actually need to swap over to each of these to quickly level them up. Abilities, there we go. Gotta get that perfect evade for all of them, you know. Come on. Oh, right, I have to double confirm. I have to I have to reassure the game that I'm not accidentally swapping characters. <laughs> All right, Barbara. <clears throat> Your turn out on the town for a bit. All right, exit the Belfry and patrol Gotham City.
Dark Knight's Patrol. Yes, please. God, she looks badass. Okay. I have to interrogate freaks and the mob, so let's do this. All right. Get on the bike. Oh shit, it's telling me to turn around. Why is it telling me to turn around? GPS, shocker, but like... I haven't been playing too much Watch Dogs Legion. I keep trying to drive on the left side of the road. It's taking me to one in particular. I got it. Okay. What's this? Victim deceased. Investigate. I love that it's a flash. Yeah. That my mouse is a flashlight. Wedding ring. Screwdriver. Yeah. Fingerprints on the screwdriver match some lifted from a freak connected homicide in Southside. I love okay. how quick that happens. Right. Victim of the freaks had some fun with this city worker before leaving him to die. Wedding ring, victim's wedding ring, and engraving re inside reads until death do we part. Scorch marks, they burned the victim. These scorch marks are consistent with ignited gasoline. Fingerprints on this handle match. So that's a ladder rung, not a handle. Um, match the victims. Right. Okay. Gasoline may have been used to intimidate the victim as a potential accelerant. That's really funny. Okay. That's if they actually poured it on him. Well, they did because scorch marks are consistent with ignited gasoline. Oh, true. You're right. But they don't look like they actually lit him on fire with it so much as... No. They might have because splashed be... it on the wall. Yeah, because he should be more burned. Yeah. Than just, you know, damage. Got it. You know, pour <laughs> pouring gasoline does, you know... Getting there. Right. They said they need us here. That asshole better pay here soon. Interrogate, right? Yeah, the one down here is an interrogate one. 
But these two, I need to get rid of before I do anything with them. We're attracting attention. Here comes that girl. That's the one you need to interrogate. Mm, nope, the one with the question mark. Footwork. Oh, okay. They moved then. Tell me what you know about Kirk Langstrom's murder. We didn't have any reason to kill him, let alone pin him to a wall. He paid us well to take part in his medical trials. Oh, but don't tell my boss. She'll have my skin. Thanks for the info. Uh, all you asked was tell me about his murder? Why the pinning to the wall? Because Kirk Langstrom was pinned to the wall. Yeah, but no, I mean, like... If the police are calling it an accident, for saying they don't know anything about it, they knew he was pinned to a wall. It's, yeah, that's a very valid point. I just. Um, so I'm like, I don't know if that's a purposeful statement or if that's just the uh, designer is kind of missing that. It might be that. It could also be that the, um, that the. The GCPD in this version of Gotham are corrupt as fuck, and so it's entirely possible that the criminals know more than the cops let uh, tell the public, you know? Well, sure. All right. Not that that's um, not almost always the case anyway. That true. doesn't have to be corruption so much as keeping a thing quiet. True. I mean, it's after all, they often will keep certain key elements secret while they're trying to figure things out use it as a way to limit false potentials. Right. <clears throat> and so it's probably it's probably just word of the under of the underworld of the underworld. God, English is such a bitch. Welcome for walking off. Probably best if you're not here when my backup gets here. Hmm. Maybe the commission's wrong about you. I know you don't think so, but we're on the same team. You better commission. Out before backup arrives. Okay, commission being though, not Jim Gordon. He didn't even go to make sure you knocked them out. Right. He didn't even cuff him. He just stood there and said, yeah, I'm calling for backup now. <laughs> Basically. All right. Um... I know you did. I don't even need to look. I know, I know you probably knocked him out so well. I don't need to cuff him. <laughs> yeah, Before my backup gets here. <laughs> Armed robbery in progress. There's one over here, too. Let's do that. now it just didn't like your order yeah Apparently. I hope you can keep the city safe. Oh, GCPD, I made a mistake. <laughs> Back 
So without stretching those legs. Now we know how they did it. <laughs> yep. And are you supposed to do something else now with it? No, leave it for the GCPD. Okay. I mean, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I leveled up. Hmm. Uh, ooh, I like that. I like this. I like that. All right. Wait, wrong button. Damn it. Give me this. All right. Um, let's do this one because that's what we were trying to do before. Before I got immediately distracted. game is pretty. It's right there. I should do it. Yeah, I got time. <laughs> oh, oh my. Okay. Lots of red things down there. Yep. Okay. I don't. I don't. And I don't want to go in fighting first because I will probably die. Proceeds to go in through the front door. Jk. Lucky bastard. Sorry, did I say that out loud? Of course you did. <laughs> Surprise. I may have no shame, but that's not news to y'all. Okay. Well. Apparently, yeah. No guns. Saw that opening a mile away. We're out of here. Oh, we're the... you better... oh. Can I? Okay, that works. You lost it's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to do, but I'll take it. It's like you guys aren't even trying anymore. Have to move. Ah, there's some stuff to pick up over here. 
pick up those little question marks and now we GTBFO. They're probably going to try to pin that robbery on me. Apparently an informant. In the van. Oh shoot, they got reinforcements. Oh, good, good call. I wasn't even looking at the health. There's three waves. I'm on uh, sec second of three. Yeah. Ooh, that 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 looks like it hurt. Oh hi! You can actually see the person. Dang. You should be safe now. Nah, he's probably safer in that until GCPD gets... I'm just snickering at the fire. <laughs> eh, it'll be fine. Probably be watching where I'm driving, huh? Dang it! I know that name. And that wall.
favor and stay down. Oh, hi. Let's do this. Oh, that just falls off. <laughs> right. Ooh, there's a chest over there. Let's go get that. Okay. Then we'll let the guy out. Person? Who's the person? A hostage. So you don't have to free them. No, I do. It says to free them in the top left. I'm just. What's that? What's what? That? That. No, Not speaker system. The red thing. The red thing. Over here? Oh, that and the other one. So they're incendiary bar barrels and you're not supposed to do anything to them until it's hit? No, they're just there for dealt me in combat. Wrong button. All right. All right. So that is ten forty two. Um, I'm thinking. <clears throat> that I'm gonna call it on stream for now. Okay. Ooh. Momentum suit, thrill seeker suit, link suit, fast progression suit, momentum ability suit. Interesting. Okay. How do you enjoy the cute one? Which which one's the cute one? The bottom this one? one? Yeah. I'm yeah, this is the one that's the, uh... This is the one that's the actual uh one for the game. Ah, okay. It, it's it's the one that's based on the Babstar design. The what? Uh Babstar's Batgirl redesign. Uh it's the oh. one that I have the Funko Pop of up here. Okay. It's it's my favorite Batgirl outfit design. But uh -huh. this is basically it's based off of it, but it's dissimilar enough that uh, you know anyway collectibles um okay well well um yeah that's what i'm gonna call it for the night um thanks you all thanks to uh ursa for popping into the discord chat um and thanks to anybody, uh, everybody else who's uh, was who's been who joined me tonight. Um, that's it from me for the week. Um, before we head out, though, um, be sure to check out these amazing people I have listed up here at the top, which includes Yvonne B, Melador219, and a few others. I have even more recommendations in the uh, link tree down here, down at the bottom of my screen. Um, and speaking of that link tree. Um, if you go to the link tree on screen, which is link tree slash crimson night, you'll find links to my socials, my discord, my, uh, Patreon, which is patreon.com slash crimson night, where, uh, you can support me and, um, stuff like that. 
Um, and there's also a throne wish list in there, so you can get me something nice if you want. If not, it's fine. Um, I won't hold it against you or anything like that. But yeah, there's a lot of awesome things in that link tree if you want to go to it. <coughs> but, um, yeah. Anyway, like I said, that's it for me for the night. So, remember to have empathy, be kind, be safe. Love yourselves and love everyone around you, and I will see you all next time. I love you all. Peace out. Yeah. <laughs>